Amen. You may be seated. Good morning, boys and girls. Good morning. <laughs> you know, it's always a good day to come and worship the Lord Jesus here at First Baptist Church. And I appreciate you being here. Now, look, we're going to get straight into this little lesson today, okay? I want to tell you about one of my favorite verses. Not my favorite, but it's one of my favorites. It's in Proverbs, and it's in chapter 3, verse number 5 and 6. Most people in this building can probably quote this verse. But I want to tell you about the verse, and then I want to illustrate the verse. Y'all ready for that? Got your ears on? All right, here, here's the way it goes. Proverbs 3, 5, 6 says this. Trust in the Lord with all your what? Heart. That's right. We, we're, we, we can say that part good, but this next part. It's tangling, okay? No words. Uh, this is where it gets tough. It says, trust in the Lord with all your heart. Lean not on your own understanding. God did not call you, boys and girls, to figure it out. He calls you to trust. Okay? So trust in the Lord with all your heart. Lean not on your own, own understanding in all your ways. Acknowledge him, and he will direct your paths. Now then, I want to illustrate that first. You see, boys and girls, when you come to Jesus, you give all. You don't ask questions. You don't ask why. You just trust God. You give him everything in every way. I want to illustrate that. When God ask you to come to him, this is what he's asking you to do. Alyssa, jump to my arms. <laughs> Folks, when you give God your life, you can't hang on to that. Let's pray. Father, forgive us, Lord, for trying to tell you how we'll come. God, thank you that when you said trust in you, we're to leap into your arms. No attachments, no questions, no doubting, just trust. So God, 